Hey, what's up? Mwende Masharia here, the queen of airways. Once again, it's the queen's podcast. Karibu sana. Of course, we are here at Tamarid Tree Hotel, situated along Langata Road. I'm telling you, mwanzo ni megundu wa sijakuja branch for a while now. This Sunday, I'll be joining Tamarid for the branch. Make sure you do. Right about now, kwa mgeni wangu. Wow, 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 wow. Hey, no go show, by the way. <laughs> the one and the only, super amazing, mm. Alex Mokideu. Oh, yes. A.K.A. Oh, yes. The newest mm. movie star in town. All right. The one and the only mm. chair. All right. Mambo vipi. Safi kabisa. <laughs> Umesahau mambo mengi katika introduction yako. Umesahau. Mambo mengi sana. Endeleza, 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 endeleza chair. Um, mm. Radio Guru. Asante. Andu umesahau, sorry. Radio Guru. Radio Guru. You know, um, father. Father. Husband. Loving husband. Loving, loving husband. husband in Ingilia. And an awesome dad. Uh, All right. Uh-huh, uh-huh. And a um, uh, mm. business mogul. Business mogul. Business mogul. Proprietor. Proprietor, yes. Yes, sir. You know. Uh, Umesahau mambo mengi. Proprietor, owner of Pampered Ride. Pampered Ride. Yes. Sir. Or Pampered Enterprise. Ah, tunele, tunele. Chasi, tunele. Tunele, tunele. You know. You know. <laughs> <laughs> mambo mipi. Fiti, my dear. How you doing? Nimekumis. 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 Nimekumis, you're looking know. amazing. Thank you so much. Napenda mambo mengi ambayo yanaendelea katika mwili wako. Unanipa raha. Unanipa raha. Unanipa raha. No, 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 no. no. It is what it is. No, it is. It is what it is. is, what it is. It is what it is. Na shukuru. Na shukuru. Eh, inaleta raha. Inaleta burudani. Bakia hapo hapo ulipo. Asante. Mm. Asante. Chia karibu. Karibu. Mashuku, what are you having? Ni, ni chakula, ni, ni show ya chakula, kula, mbona ni chakula tangu ni hapa nana. Hapana hapa ni tamarinda. Unaje enjoy. Mm. Che you don't drink any more honey tena hapo. No, I don't drink any more. Mm? I don't drink any more. That's a nini? Unajua nimetoka hii ni latte. 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 Napenda coffee sana. Wow. Nilipoacha ulevi niliamua kutafuta kitu ambacho kinaweza ku ku substitute. Ku substitute. Eh. Nikapata hii latte ikawa ndo mambo yote. Sasa hii mm, Cheers to a great show. To an awesome show. Amen. Yeah. Amen. Nimesema amen. Wewe Kitu gani kilifanya uache pombe? Ah, sasa mambo mengi mengi tu si mm. kitu kimoja basically. Mm. But mambo mengi madogo madogo sio makubwa of course mm. si kuwa ikuwa mgonjwa. Eh. Pombe haikuwa ikunisababishia ajali. Mm. Si kuwa ikuwa na madhara yoyote ya kiafya mm. ya pombe, you know. Mm. That's why mimi wa marafiki zangu wanaolewa na ambia lewe ni twataisti wa sumbulo. <laughs> Maana kesho ulikuwa unapiga. Mimi na jojo. Na hiyo kesi. Watu wale hawajui kwa nini eh, ninamwita chair. Eh. Ni kwa sababu alikuwa Alex Magdo anapiga. Eh, Maana kesho kama ni shango ni shango. Mimi ndio nilikuwa nakuitachia so kama unajua kwani nilikuwa nakuitachia. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> kama ni shango ni full ah, shango. Inapigwa, inapigwa, inashuka, inakwenda, inateremka. Yeah. Mm, ilikuwa Mala... tunasema sisi hakuna kubembeleza punda kwa mteremko. Punda, eh. Kama punda anateremka ashuke. Ashuke akendaga. Hakuna kubembeleza. <laughs> so ni kama lori, lori ya makaa inashuka kwa kwa mteremko pale kibarani. Unaona? <laughs> Na haina break. <laughs> so nataka kuelewa, yani kitamu ndofiki hiyo decision kwamba mm. cheki Mm. Kwa sababu mimi mwenyewe kama you know mm. mimi kama chiko chair mm. nilikuwa na, nilikushangaa you know mm. watu wengi mm. walikushangaa watu wengi wali, mm. waliona ni kama ni uongo uh. when you said you're not drinking alcohol anymore Yeah because watu wengi wakaona ah huyu jamaa ataweza kweli itakuwaaje mm. maana kidaja maana anapenda sherehe sherehe nayo naipenda sure mm. So ikawa eh watu wakaona kama ni mzaa lakini ilikuwa ni hivyo tu. Was it a decision ya siku moja? Ya siku moja tu? Walai. No of course lakini ilikuwa kulikuwa na build up. Build up eh, kulikuwa na build up. Ni ukweli kulikuwa na ile story ya nilianza story ile ya kila mwaka napiga one month break. Mm, eh nakumbuka. Kila mwaka nakumbuka ile mm. napiga one month break. Sasa mm. ikawa napiga actually the last month nilipiga break ya December. Mm. You know now December na ujondo mwezi wa sherehe. Ilikuwa mwaka gani ule? Ilikuwa ni ilikuwa ni 20 I think 2018. 2018. I think so because I, I think I'm four years now. You're four years now. Four years sober, yes. So 2018 December ni yes. piga ya mwisho. Nilipiga December ya mwisho. Okay. okay. Yes. Mm-hmm. Yes, December yangu ya mwisho nikapiga sherehe ikawa um ikawa nimesema hiyo December sikunywi. Mm, Ushaliona? Mm, mm, because tulikuwa tunachagua mwezi wowote. Mm, Unaona kama 2022. Mm, you must pick one month. Mm, Nilikuwa lazima nisemeni pick one month ambayo nitaka soba. Mm, so what spend ku pick December? Kwa sababu December ikifika niwe niko ta. Nishachagua huko mamachi, ma February, miezi mm, boring mm, ama January sana sana. Haina kitu. Mwanzo mwanzo eh, una pesa kwanza. Sasa ule mwaka ulikuwa umeniteka na sherehe sana. Mm, January mm, kija ni sherehe, February Mm-hmm. Sasa nikaona sema nitafanya match match ya re nitafanya mm-hmm. April paka ikafika November 31st <laughs> nikabaki na December nikasema sasa inabidi tu nifanye December because hakuna ku cross over hata ufanye 2 months mm-hmm. At next year for two months. Mm. Akuna crossing over. Mm. So nikapiga December bila drink. Mm. Alafu the following year nikasema ah kama nimepiga December January ilipoingia 
nikajikuta nimeendelea ah. nikamaliza januari february nikamaliza nikarudi mm. think around march pale lakini nikasema eh nimefika karibu 3 months eh. maybe this is the end uh-huh. so mwaka nika hiyo siku tulikuwa tumeenda tumeenda sherehe fulani ya inaitwa nini ilikuwa ni introduction Mm. ya ndugu yangu huyu eh, Felix ah. the war bonge wala kata mhesh huyu mhesh alikuwa anaenda introduction kule kwa wife wake mm. so mimi nilikuwa nimekwenda kule unajua lazima niongee on behalf of marafiki mm. ushaona mm. sasa usiku wake nao nimekata maji kama kitu nyingine na ulikuwa nakata chair na nilikuwa nakata nakata ulikuwa nakata sasa mimi chair niko pale home nimerudi mm. usiku wa manane nimelala nimekula keyo mm. nimekula keyo mimi ikafika time na bumburusho na simu mm. Simu nikibumburuka nikiangalia kwenye WhatsApp ile yeah. group yetu ile ya, eh. ya kuenda kwa introduction. Eh. Eh, naona watu washapiga pamba, <laughs> watu washafika ile meeting point yetu, watu wana check wanapiga mapicha. Na sasa group imejaa. Mm. Mimi ndo nimeamka. Mm. Niko maji. Spokesman. Spokesman. Mm. Nikasema hapa kufa gari kufa dereva. Nikaingia shower nikasimama kwanza dakika kama tano hivi. Pigwa na shawa baridi, pigwa na shawa baridi. Dakika tano kama nikatoka hivi nikapiga suti yangu madigaga lina nini? Mm. Nisiolekane na maulevi zangu. Mm. Nikaenda kapiga sherehe tukamaliza mm. na washikaji wangu tu wale wote mm. so leo tukitoka pale watu wanafungwa mabuti yes. mabuti ziko na mizinga ndani a jamaa sherehe ndani i mean kaambia jamaa na krimi nimemaliza wacha and that was it no way paka leo no way eh lakini niliongea fiti on behalf of marafiki nikamaliza jamaa alipofungwa fungua ile ah, vipi jamaa short 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 mimi nikaambia na kiri na kiri um, this is it ah. paka dakika hii wacha eh paka dakika hii ngoja nikuulize kwa sababu mimi najua ulikuwa unapiga ila mbao shaipiga mimi najua ulikuwa unaweza kushusha whisky unaangusha eh chupa nzima zinga yenu najua ulikuwa unaweza like ulikuwa which is the worst you had ever done hii ni shogani jamani hii ni shogani jamani unaanza kukuleta zaidi sikuambiwa haikuwa katika maswali ya isho isho ilikuwa makuwa maswali ilikuwa gani kulikuwa na maswali tu naambiwa kuhusu nafsi inspirational familia hatukuwa nimeambiwa kwamba kutakuwa na maswali kama haya karibu unajua sasa unajua unajua isho kwa superstar sasa hivi uko Netflix sasa hivi Eh. Uko Netflix sote na kuwatch sasa. Eh, dunia nzima, dunia. Eh, dunia nzima, nzima. global. Kwa Marekani, eh. kwa Ujerumani, eh. kwa Ufaransa mm. na nchi zingine nyingi za kimataifa. Sasa tuambie. Nashukuru wale wote walionipigia simu. Unaendelea vizuri. Mambo yanaenda. Sasa, sasa 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 ile ile kukata maji, mm. ile kukata maji ina, masi, ina ina story nyingi tunaweza maliza hii hadithi. Eh. Tunaweza maliza. Hii <laughs> podcast tunaweza <laughs> tunaweza 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 kwambia tu ya hadithi ya Ujerumani yeah. nilikuwa niko Ujerumani kule kazi kidogo mm. sasa ikawa ni birthday yangu ah. sasa katika ile birthday yangu ikawa wale jamaa wame surprise my colleagues utakushaona mm. mm. ile vipi eh birthday colleague eh birthday wangu leo eh sasa unajua kule Ujerumani na pombe unajua nchi ya pombe ni nchi ya pombe sasa mdosi yeah. yule Mjerumani akawa miandaa yani mm. bia na mawai na kadhalika mimi nikaingia mm. na kindo mambo yangu yale mm. nikaingia kata maji kata maji kata maji kata maji chakula ipo of course mm. na kila kitu mm. na kadhalika na mazaga zaga mengi mm. nikapiga simu washikaji wangu wawili wa Mombasa mm. wameishi pale Free Town huwa jamaa wa Free Town ah. tuko nao bono huko mmoja anaitwa dogo wamjua la Benson na Miami anamjua eh. namjua <laughs> na rafiki yangu mwingine anaitwa Anesti wamjua eh. eh. <laughs> wakakuja mara moja eh. jamaa baadhi yangu na mimi kuna surprise hapa John Shere tuko Germany hapa sasa tumekutana na jamaa Mombasa wangapi? Aya ya ya ya. Watatu. Nayo 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 nayo. Tukatoka pale tukasema sasa tuingie bond sasa ma club hopping. Mm. Club hopping, club hopping, club hopping na kukata maji tu. Mm. Ilikuwa ni winter. Mm. So unajua winter unaweza kukunywa sana. Ah, you understand? Because kuna baridi. Cold. So you can actually drink a lot of bottles. Mm. So nilikuwa nimekunywa chupa kama kama navy za wine. Mm. Alafu ah. na beer kadha. Sikudanganyi. <laughs> Mungu moja nilikuwa nimekunywa sana. <laughs> Now uh, ikafika time kila mtu lazima tuagane. Uh, so, so mimi niko pale mimi naishi town, uh, okay? Naishi town kabisa maana yake pale Bon ukipanda ile bus uh, si kuna stops 1 2 3 4. Uh, mimi the fourth stop itakana nishuke. Uh, Actually where I live I can ride a bicycle to town. Uh, Mmeelewa eh? Uh, na kuna watu tunafanya pale Dochevelle walikuwa wanaweza kuendesha bicycle tu wakaenda kazini. Uh, Wengi tu wanaishi hapo around mimi naishi. Uh, So nimefika pale na ngoja basi unajua basi zinakuja zile basi za usiku kabisa after midnight uh, zinakuja after kama 30 minutes. Uh-huh azikuja after 5 minutes zile kama za, za mchana. Mm. So nimeka, na hizo basi za usiku after midnight huwa ni za city to city. Ah, so inapiga ah. kama ni Cologne, Bonn inaingia paka Amsterdam. Mhm. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Inchi uh. eh, huko Holland, <laughs> Netherlands. Mimi nikapanda moja, uh. sasa nipanda moja na hakuna watu, maana ni usiku. Ni usiku eh. Eh ni dereva tu na watu kama wawili vile nikakaa pale. Mm. Niko maji. 
so nikaka pale nikaka pale mm. kwa kiti nikasikia na kula keyo mm. eh nikasema vile naishi karibu nikikula keyo ndio hivyo sasa uko Amsterdam wallahi niko Amsterdam eh. ah nikasema hapana acha nisimame eh. nikasimama nikashika chuma eh. na niko peke yangu vitu vimejaa basi <laughs> nikikaa tu mimi nakula keyo nikashika chuma so kushika chuma and this is a true story yeah. Yeah. by the time the next stop inafika au yeah. leave ni kitu kibaya yeah. nilijikuta nimekaa na nimekula keyo the next stop i don't know from kwa chuma mpaka ukaa mpaka kukaa mm. na kula keyo manake gari kisimama nasema ile chuma yeah. alafu inashukisha ile inajishuka inajishuka mm. chini ile mtu apande so when that happens nashtuka nikishtuka ah nasema mbona nimekaa Siko ni sasa nisimame mimi. Eh. Maana kini stage ya kwanza ile mm. ya pili kipita na tatu mimi naenda. Nikasema matena. Ya pili the same thing to mm. be very honest. So ya tatu sikusikia mm. na nne ndo ninakoishi. Mm. Ya nne ndo nitakana nishuke pia eh. sikusikia. Eh. Nikala keyo completely. Basi nayo 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 nayo. nayo. Stage ya kwanza wapi? Nikumbuka naishi town eh. kwa city kabisa. Eh. So by the time I'm waking up mm naona miti na milima miti na milima yani you know in town you don't see that of course you understand mm. so naona miti na nikambe taita bodolo <laughs> 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 mama yangu niko taita mimi <laughs> maze miti na milima nikamka nikafuata dereva yule kumuuliza mm. tuko wapi in where are we dereva ajui ki kiingereza sana mm. mm. aka struggle struggle pale akaniuliza kani where do you want to go mimi nikamwambia mimi nilikuwa nashuka Clemens aga shitwas ah. Clemens aga shitwas uh akasema oh my god that is too far away akasema we are almost in holland <laughs> tunaingia amsterdam says mna <laughs> sio mrefu shit tunaingia amsterdam <laughs> shit nikamwambia mazini lazima nirudi eh shukisha next stage mimi nashuk akaniambia hapa stage au utapata basi eh. hakuna gari mm. hakuna chochote hakuna uba itakupandia hakuna uba hakuna taxi sasa hivi usiku sana you won't get anything and then again it's um kuna tisha unaelewa mm, eh mm, ni mali in the middle of nowhere mm, ushaona zile katika movie zile stages za basi mtu amekaa in the middle of nowhere eh, you know akaniambia hapa hakuna lolote mm, wewe vuka tuingie Amsterdam <laughs> ushaona alafu tu wewe kubali matokeo <laughs> lala kwa basi alafu asubuhi saa 12 kuna dereva mwingine atakuu kesho dereva wa next duty wa next job ama uko job kesho kesho yake siko job ah, wa next duty ataingia eh, akiingia yule wa next duty utarudi naye eh, paka Clemens Agast eh, Simba jamii nilikuwa nakata ile tiketi mm. ya mwezi mzima mm. ya kutumia mm. transport mm. system. I mean nikasema iwez. Nitavukaje Amsterdam sina hata passport. Wajua ninge nchi nyingine? Wengi nchi nyingine. Nikafikiria hizo vitu vingi nikasema hapana naweza kuwa nachoma. Mm. Mimi nikamwambia shuka nikashuka. Kadi maji na uzi in the middle of nowhere. In a new country. All alone. Alafu kuna baridi kama saitan. Nilikuwa nipiga ile kuta. Yaani nilikaa pale kama dakika tano mm. pombe yote ikaisha. <laughs> Chupa zako zote nne. Zote zikakuwa flat. Sasa nimekaa pale na ngoja e, gari yote ile. Mm. <laughs> gari ile kuja kwanza. Ni na maganya kulo pale. You know? <laughs> gari yoyote ije tu mtu anione huruma. Sasa unajua nimevaa hudi na nimevaa zile gloves zile. Mm. Na nimevaa mabuti. Yaani niko kiwinta. Mm. Nikaibi maji taxi nakuja nikasema misha taxi taxi nakuja. Nasema karibu na mimi naangalia ikiangalia hivi naona mtu mweusi amevaa hudi gloves koti kubwa taxi na nyorosha shap. you know like who ni nani in the middle of nowhere anataka eh hey, taxi unaogopa mm. so taxi kama mbili zinilipita mm. kwa kuogopa tu by the way mm. nika notice ah, mbona wasimami hawa nikao naona niogopa la kwa hivyo kwa nani no, kuna jamali eh, jamaa fulani kutoka indonesia ah. eh, taxi driver tu pia okay, okay. alikuja kaangalia akaona ah, yeye pia ni mgeni mgeni kidogo mm. akanisimamisha nikamwelezea story mbona watu walikuwa wanalipita ndo akaniambia labda wana kuogopa okay. kanambia okay. lakini mimi pia ni mimi mtu nimetoka indonesia so mimi nikasema potele ya pote. So nikamuuza naenda wapi? Mm. Nini kamambia naenda Clemens Agas Tours. Mm, mm. Akaniambia uko tayari kulipa. <laughs> <laughs> Unaenda wapi? Ah. Naenda Clemens. Uko tayari kulipa? Ah. Kamambia sina budi. Mm. Talipa tu. Kama kilomita ngapi sasa tunazungumzia? Kikilomita mm. sijui. Oh, Lakini okay. naweza kuambia nilipa ngapi? Ngapi? Dola ngapi? Hela za Kenya eh. ilikuwa ni euro eh? eh. So hela za Kenya zilipika kama 38,000 ah. and something. Eh, the most expensive ride of my life. Wow. I swear to God. My... 38,000 and something. Na hiyo baada ya kukataza kunywa pombe. Anyway, hakuna shida. Nilienda kama kwa ATM nikatoa hela. Yaani kumlipa huyu jamaa. Sasa sasa sasa. 
Nikasema wallahi kesho sinywi tena mimi. Na kesho yake? Ah ndani. Ah. <laughs> ah ndani. Sasa chia vile baba umeja kunywa, una burudika vipi? Huwa ni nini? Kuna vitu vingi na vingi vizuri vizuri. Vitu vipo. Vitu vipo. Ukinruhusu. Ukinruhusu niende kwa gari nikachukue. Oh, oh, oh kwa gari? Kwa gari yangu zipo sasa. Tumani ama kwa gari yangu zipo sasa vitu. Eh. Vya kunburudisha. Kama nini? Vipo. Sigara. Ah sigara sivuti. Sigara uvuti. Sigara sivuti. Mm. Ushai tamani, ushai vuta. Ushai vuta sigara. Nilijaribu. Mm. Eh, nilijaribu. <laughs> nilijaribu mambo mengi. Nilijaribu sigara nikaona ah, sahihi. Mm. Najua sitia time. Nikaona ileti shamu. Ah, ileti shamu. Mwanangu ana vitu strong. Eh, nataka sigara nimevuta. Na sigara. Najua mambo yako ile koko gari ile. Ile najua mambo yako sana ile. Actually nilikuwa nafikiri unaweza kuja nayo hapa. Nilikuwa natarajia. You know, unajua whisky iko na sigara na whisky iko na vibe yake. Ushanielewa eh? na ukiwa wewe ni mtu unapenda sigaa unapenda whisky lazima uelewe ndio maana watu wanashangaa nikisema mm. nilikuwa na nyachupa ya whisky mm. it is true that you can actually drink a whole bottle of whisky mm. but you must understand how to t- to drink whisky okay kuna how mm. sio unywe tu how ni ushanielewa exactly. eh? yeah. kwa mfano yeah. whisky yoyote ambayo ni single malt whisky ah. ni whisky nzuri Shanielewa eh? No, Ukipata whisky nzuri eh, kama ile mm. unaiweka kama shot moja kwenye glasi ya whisky. Okay. Unaweka kama shot moja na pia mandhari lazima uangalie. Eh. Unakunywa whisky wapi? Eh. Shanielewa? Mandhari mazuri, alafu upate ile glasi yako ya whisky, mm. uweke shot moja. Okay. So ukiweka shot moja yako ya whisky na kuendaga na one drop of water. Okay. Shanielewa? Eh, kama lazima uchanganye. Okay. Weka tu one drop. Ukiweka tu maji kidogo tu. tu. Ile maji ukiweka ukifanya hivi ukizungusha mm. uki ile whisky kidogo round mm. utaona ile layer ya oil ile pale kwa glass ile mm. ushanielewa mm. alafu kinusa utasikia ile harufu nzuri ya whisky mm. sasa ile maji huwa inafanya ina, 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 inagawanya zile flavors ah. zinashika kote zile flavors ah, zainea yes mm. sasa una, alafu una sip pole pole mm. ushanielewa so mara nyingi ile whisky unyu na maji ama na soda hapo mm. ndo una leo una kwa mjinga mm. lakini ukinywa vile unaweza maliza chupa walai walai na utalewa Utalewa kama mjinga. Mm. Utaongea vizuri na uta drive na uta... okay, okay. usi drive. Usi drive. Usiendeshe gari ukilewa. Usiendeshe gari ukilewa. Mm. Eh, lakini una sigara inaingilia wapi sasa pale? Sigara inaingilia wapi? So sigara, sigara mm. huwa iko na sigara huwa iko na flavors tofauti tofauti. Mm. Eh, Cuban sigara napenda sana. Na yua, so sigara ile iko na culture yake pia. Kwanza mm. kabisa lazima ujue kuiwasha. Mm-hmm. Shanielewa mm. na kuikata pale nyuma. Eh? kuna watu huikata pale nyuma alafu mm. bado aka wavutaji wale wa mm. sigara kubwa mm. <laughs> <laughs> unaweza kuikata nyuma pale kuna watu mimi najua mm. ambao ikata nyuma pale alafu akatumbukiza ile mm. ile sigara yake ile ndogo pale ndani ile ndogo unaelewa ile ndogo wastani e, ile wastani ile imerodiwa vizuri <laughs> akaitumbukiza pale sasa akishikilia hivi mm. unaona kama mbaya anavuta sigara tu mm. lakini pia anavuta vitu vyake vingi vitu vyake sasa anasikia vitu vingi tu na anapata raha pale ile umepiga nini mwisho ha <laughs> Sasa skiza sasa. Sasa ile uki, uh, ukiwasha kwanza mm. lazima uiwashe round. Iwake round pamoja, siwake side moja. Mm. So inataka ile matchbox ndefu mm. ama inataka cigar lighter yenyewe. Mm. Sasa iwake round vizuri na unaiwasha huku ukivuta, ukitoa moshi ukivuta. Ukivuta au au vuti ile moshi ndani. Si kama sigara. Oh. Au vuti ile moshi ndani. Because ile moshi ukikaa tu kwa mdomo wako una, una, unaleta zile flavors zake. Oh. kwa mdomo wako. Yeah. So kuna sigara nyingine ukivuta ukivu, inataka inataka na yende na whisky. Kuna nyingine inaenda mpaka kahawa. Shanielewa? Ndio nilikwenda kukujikuliza na hapo kwa sababu eh. unajua sigara bado unaitumia sigara. Eh. Kwa hivyo unapiga na kahawa sio. Unapiga na kahawa. Oh. Sasa kuna zile za kahawa unapiga na kahawa pole pole. Na ukipata sigara moja unaweza kama mimi labda naweza ivuta kama hata kwa miezi mitatu. Mm. Si hata unavuta sigara unamaliza, eh. avuti maliza. Okay. Unaivuta unaikata unaiwata unaika kwa box yake oh. eh, unakuja kuendelea pole pole lakini nataka mandhari pia uivuti everywhere okay mandhari yakikubali kabisa nasema this is the moment this is the hour this is the hour this is the moment and the hour and, the hour. Mm. and then you sit and enjoy hutamani pombe hutamani ailisha mm. kuna wakati nilikuwa natamani sikudanganya ah. mm. sana sana ilikuwa nikienda nikienda Mombasa ah. ama nikienda ah. Voi home eh. unajua hii weather ya joto mm. mimi nilikuwa napenda whisky yangu siku zote kabla sijaifungua na nywa bia mbili baridi. Mm, Shona, mm. napiga bia mbili baridi ile kama kuambia mwili kata tayari. Mm. Sasa tunaingia kwa shangu. Unaelewa? <laughs> It's about to go down. It's about to go down. Sasa nikienda Mombasa ile jua kali, alafu niende nikae pale kwa ile ile hotel ile ba ile ile ba ya kule kwa beach. Mm. Ile ba ya kule. Ile maana ni, ni beach ba ile. Ile beach ba. Mm. Napenda sana mimi. Mm. Sasa nilikuwa napenda sasa siku hizi nikienda nikae pale kwa beach ba na una mzungu ameletewa bia baridi. Bia baridi. Inamtameta. Yaani 
Yeah. Alafu unajua sasa ile ya hoteli upewa paka glass pia ni baridi. Eh. Yeah. Yeah. Glass pia ni baridi imetoka kwa fridge. Yeah. Alafu unamwona anaiweka kutu 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 namcheki yule mzungu hivi. Kutu kutu kutu. Alafu anaisipi hivi nasema oh Yesu wangu niokoe baba. Nishikilie. Kristo nishikilie. Kristo nishikilie baba. Hey. You know, you know, hiyo nayo ilikuwa inanilemea. Mm. Sitakudanganya. Hiyo hiyo ilikuwa inanilemea. Maana kama Mombasa mimi nilikuwa napenda bia. Mm. Kwa sababu ya joto. Yes, yes, yes. E, bia ni fit zaidi kushinda whisky. Mm. Whisky unless usiku ufike eh. na uwe kule baharini unapigwa na upepo ndio unywe whisky. Mm. Sasa ile ilikuwa inanipiga sana. So nikaja nikaishtukia siri yake. Mm. Nikitetemeka hivyo sana eh. namwambia nipatie tu maji baridi. Okay. E, nipatie tu 1 liter maji baridi. Kwa hiyo Mombasa hivyo mambo ya hapo is done with you wale. No, but I'm, I'm, I'm doing 20 years and I'll be back. Oh, Isuti, enta rudi hapa ah, ni Ah, no, bado miaka 16. <laughs> <laughs> bado miaka 16. I'm oh, doing 20 years. Oh, you years. Yes, and I'll why be back. Years? I don't even know why. Okay, but uh, the break to me jipa 20 years. Okay. Mimi nataka nipige ile katika utuzima. Nasemaje? Mm. Nasema watoto wangu wakishatoka nyumbani. Chelelewa eh? Sasa watoto wangu mimi nimewapatia Adele. Naambia mimi nikishapiga miaka 20 tokeni. Eh, kama umeolewa au hujaolewa wewe naenda bwana. Mimi nisha malizana na we. Sasa niache na bibi yangu tukae tutengeneze cocktails mm. eh, katika uh, beach plot yetu kule mm. na you know to enjoy yoko Mombasani hivyo mm. tu mm. tunapiga drinks zetu tuna, tunapata raha. Okay. Piga drinks tuvute vitu vyetu tufurahie. Mvute. Eh tuvute vitu vyetu. Kwa hiyo. Ati? Na unavuta bangi kwa. Sijakusikia swali lako. <laughs> Nakuuliza. Eh. Chee unavuta bangi. Sijakusikia vizuri. Sijasikia una una Ngoja nkuulize. Eh. Unaonaje legalization ya kitu? Ya, ya bangi. Eh. Sai kufia sai pale tuko karne sai ya tutitusek tuko tu itaboesha 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 ikiwa legalized yeah. watu wanaivuta sana siku hizi <laughs> na hata iko legalized ikiwa legalized itaboesha itaboesha mm. ita itaboesha mm. itaboesha wajua ibaki vile vile illegal ni kama mpango wa kando ah. bangi ni kama mpango wa wajua eh mm. sasa watu wakishambua ah wewe ni tu msiwe na wasiwasi wewe ni tu eh. ah watu wataona ah i let it rot tena i let it rot tena I let it out there. Yeah, you know, watu uh, bangi tu wanapenda tu zile za. Yes. Unajua unavuta ukiangalia angalia. <laughs> Kama kuna unavuta hiyo ndo raha ya bangi. Ndio tutamwa bangi ule. Lakini tu watembea wavuta bangi <laughs> niko hapa. Hata umeingia hapa sasa hivi tunao hapa tu. Ati nawasha bangi <laughs> kama vile Marekani. Hiyo picha si siipendi. Uipendi hiyo picha? Siipendi. Okay. Siipendi hiyo picha. Wacha tu. Lakini kwa sababu ya kwa sababu ya masuala ya bangi mbaya. <laughs> Maana bangi mbaya pia iko. Mm, bangi mbaya ni Oh, kuna bangi inachizisha vijana wengi hapa. Oh. So unaona vijana wanachizile ni bangi mbaya. Oh. Maana kama bangi yote ingekuwa mbaya, Jamaica ingekuwa ndo wazimu tupu. Elewa? <laughs> Mali kama Jamaica kama majuu, unajua kuna watu kama mm. kina Wiz Khalifa, kina Snoop Dogg wangekuwa machizi wale. Maana wale wanapiga yeah, wanapiga sana na wanapiga daily. Yeah, yeah. Wale wengekuwa wenda wazimu wakubwa. So mm. kunayo bangi hiyo. Oh. Hai ni podcast. Oh, you oh, iko tu sawa. Eh? Huko tuko podcast. Wale wana radio mwingi huko. Oh, huko tuko huru huko. Huko huko tuko radio. Ah, huko tuko huru eh? Atuko radio. Oh. Eh huko ni podcast. Unajua ah, ukiona microphone unaweza kuchanganyikia. Anyway, mimi naamini ipo bangi ambayo waweza vuta na usichizi. Mm. Ushanielewa iko bangi tu nzuri mm. ambayo unaweza vuta kwa starehe zako. Mm. Sasa ikiwa legalized mm-hmm. watakuwa wanapima. Ushanielewa mm. wanasema sasa usha, wanasema sasa hii bangi atuitaki. Okay. You get so that will help. Manake utaona katika hizo nchi ambazo bangi iko legal mm. watu machizi ya wako. <laughs> Unaelewa? <laughs> eh kule hakuna wako. Unaelewa? Manake inauzwa kwa supermarket. Na ile imepitishwa na kebs ya huko kwao. Mm. Ushanielewa? Sasa mm. hii yani it is ready and you will consume na isikufanyie madhara yote. Okay. Utasikia tu highness yako. No. Sasa kama itakuwa legalized na iwe hivyo. Mm. Eh wala. Eh wala. Eh wala watu wapate raha wavutaji wapate raha. Wavutaji. Wavutaji wapate raha. Wale wavutaji sio watu wako hapa na sisi. Why enjoy? <laughs> wa enjoy. Hakuna shida chea. Eh, eh chea wewe umetoka kwenye familia ya mm. superstar. Mm. Na kumbuka wajua tulipokuwa mimi nilipokuwa Diane. Mm-hmm. Wakina na Mwakidewo wamekuja pale wa Dufly. Mm. Eh, wajua Kwele. pale hiyo eh, mm. time uko mm. baraka. Mm. Just to tell you, alikuwa wapi? Alikuwa alishakuja hope ama alikuwa kuwapi? Alikuja hope baadaye baadaye pia lakini alikuwa baraka pia. Ah pia alikuwa baraka. Actually alikuwa baraka. Mm. Alikuwa baraka. Alafu na ule mwingine wa Germany anaitwa Jim. Chris. Eh. Mm. So alikuwa fam- how ni mtangazaji mkubwa sasa hivi kule Deutsche Welle. Oh. Eh na ni mdosi pia. Oh. Mm. Anafanya nice. vizuri sana na furahia. Nice. Mm. Nice. Nataka uniambie ku grow katika mazingira kama yale. Ilikuwa ni changu utotoni ndio mko katika familia ya you know ya kujulikana. Kwa sababu si Mombasa si tunawajua kama yeah. familia ya kujulikana. Ah, wajua nyinyi ni wadogo. Mm. Lakini wale wale tujua utotoni wanajua mm. tulipata shida. Mm. Tulipata tabu sana utotoni. Mm. Sana sana mm. sana. Mm. 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 Mm.
familia ambayo haijuizi okay oh. yani sisi tulikuwa maskini sana kweli ah hoye haye hmm. yani ki ukweli si mchezo hmm. eh manake unajua sisi tulikuwa tunaishi tu kwa ile room moja na Mombasa si tu wajeru moja. Wajeru moja si one bedroom. Ah, ah. Room moja ni room moja. Yes. Choo kiko huko nje bafu Inti, huko. Mombasa eh. manispazi. Eh. Choo ziko huko nje room ni hiyo moja. Sisi tulikuwa watoto saba, baba na mama. Wow. In one room. Mm. And you know there is just one bed. Mm. You know, mm. yeah, baba na mama. Mm. The rest of you huko. Panganeni huko eh. Na sasa unajua hakuna mattress. Ah. Eh, hakuna mattress. Ah basi. <laughs> Unapata picha kabisa. Ah, najaribu kuivuta. Sasa unajua na tukawa tumelelewa vile ikawa pia takula school fees shida kubwa sana Mzazi alikuwa anafanya kazi gani kwani? Alikuwa ni chef. Mm. Alikuwa anafanya kazi mm. pale Polytechnic. Ah. Mombasa ah. Poly pale. Ah, Poly. Eh, lakini kumbuka babangu alikuwa na familia nyingine pale awali, sio? Ah. Sasa alikuwa na watoto wale na moja before mamangu aulewe. Chanielewa? Ala. So majukumu yake alikuwa makubwa zaidi. Mm. 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 So ule mshahara wake mdogo mm. ulikuwa hauwezi. Sisi tulikuwa tunafungiwa nyumba sana na munispa. Mm. Mm. Tulikuwa tukisikia lori ya munispa inakuja tushaanza kutetemeka mm. because nyumba yetu lazima itafungiwa. Mm. Na unajua msha rent pesa ngapi? Wajua hizo nyumba. Ni ngapi? <laughs> Kama shilingi I think 180. Wacha. Eh, 180. Miaka hiyo. Ama 200, miaka eh. ile. Eh. Sasa ile mnafungiwa nyumba maana unasikia nyumba yenu haijali pia miezi 8. Mm. Manispa wa Nkasiriko ameboeka. Kila siku ni promise promise wanawafungia. Mm. So tukifungia tunakanje. Mpaka yani madhangu marehemu aende akaongeleshe nini 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 ndio waje wafungue. Mm. Ushaona wakija mm. kufungua labda wapewe labda miezi miwili hivi alafu watufungulie. Mm. Sasa ushaona ukitembea katika maeneo mengi watu wanachakula chakula pale mapipani mapipani utakuta kuna mtu anachakula. Unyuke ukienda pale wewe muende uwezi jua nini naendelea pale. Mm. Mimi najua. Mm. Pale huwa kuna kila mtu anatafuta kila kitu chake. Unaelewa? Mm. Utakuta mtu anatafuta plastic, kuna mtu mwingine anatafuta Mombasa tuko tunaita bari ghost, mm. kuna mtu anatafuta yani vitu kadha kadha ushaona? Mm. Maana depending on wewe unapeleka. Sisi tuko tunatafuta bari ghost. Mm. Bari ghost ni nini? Bari ghost Mombasa ilikuwa ni ile ushaona ile toothpaste ya kitambo. Eh. Toothpaste ya kitambo ilikuwa sio ile ya plastic. Mm ilikuwa ni ile ya ushaona ukifinya inakwama kwama ilitengenezwa plastic ndio ile rais oh kulikuwa na nyingine eh kulikuwa na nyingine ile ukifinya ukifinya katikati itakuwa ngumu kufinya huko ilikuwa, ni... ilikuwa ni aluminium ile ilikuwa ni aluminium naikumbuka ile ilikuwa inahitajika sana kuna wahindi walikuwa nachukua pale sparky ushaona sasa sisi tulikuwa ukijaza ile mfuko wa unga wa kilo mbili mm. ukijaza hizo unazikunja zinakuwa ndogo kama hivi mm. ukipata moja unaikunja mm. unatoa ile plastiki ya juu unaikunja unaeka unakunja unaeka paka ujaze mfuko wa kilo mbili mm. ukijaza mfuko wa kilo mbili hiyo mm. ni shilingi saba na sumne okay toothpaste ngoja tuelewane toothpaste ina, inaenda kujaza kama nini hiyo ikisha ikisha sio watu wanatupa pipani oh. so sisi tuko pipani Ala. E, mimi mimi brother zangu tuko tuko pipani tunazitafuta tunachakula pipani. Sasa tunakwambia ukienda pipani ukiangalia wale vijana wachafu wanatafuta. Tushakuwa pale sisi. Okay. Yes, unatafuta mm. pale pipani paka upate sisi tuko tunatafuta hizo toothpaste. Mm. Unatafuta hizo toothpaste ukipata unaziweka, unakunja unaweka, unakunja paka ujazio tukiti. Okay. Ukijaza ukimpeleka mwende na kupatia na unatembea kutoka chuda paka oh. spa. Spa na kupatia 750. Shona. Ah, tamu, 750 tamu hiyo. Eh, 750 unarudi sasa unampatia madha kama shilingi tano Shona mimi nikipata shilingi 5 wenzangu shilingi 5 vile nabaki na kama shilingi 2 na sumi. Shilingi 2 na sumi unatesa tesa pale mtaani kidogo vya zikarai na, maba, na mazaga zaga. <laughs> unatesa tesa mtaani pale. Ujadielewa. Na Mombasa kuna vya zikarai. Eh na mazaga zaga mabajia bajia na masamosa samosa na manini nini. Una, unatesa hiyo siku. Yeah. Alafu kuna mama fulani alikuwa ndo masalome pia tulikuwa tunakwenda kumtafutia. Maana kitu kosha inajulikana tunaenda mapipani. Sasa tunaenda kumtafutia vifufu, vifufu wa vijua wewe. Yeah. Hawa watu wa podcast hawajui vifufu. vifufu. Vifufu ni nazi. Ni nazi basi ile nazi ukishaitoa. Eh yeah. yeah. ile 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 inaitwa ile kile ki 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 cover chake cover ya nazi. Watu wa podcast ile yeah. ile cover ya juu yeah. ile, ile yeah. brown. Ile cover inawasha moto haraka sana. Shaona? Yeah. Eh inawasha moto haraka. Sisi ile makesa Dome alikuwa apenda zile cover kabla ajaanza kupika sa, samaki wake. So gunia zima unamletea namletea gunia nzima pale hata kupata pesa kidogo kama shilingi tatu. Mm. La nazi anakupata kama shilingi tatu alafu anakupata kama samaki kidogo. Ndio huko uko Dar es Salaam ngapi? Ushanielewa eh? Hapo niko pale kwa lower primary. Mm. Eh, pale kwa class 2, mm. class 1, mm. class 3. Mm. Ushanielewa. So ilikuwa ya yalikuja eh eh. Yalitupiga lakini baadaye alikuja kaaso wajua ya, Mungu naye. Mungu si atumia. Sangapi hiyo ndio alikuja akanyooka? Ilikuja kama 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 tuseme 19 kuanzia 1995 pale. Nini ilikuwa inatokea? Kwa sababu pale kwetu kwanza kabisa nataka upate hiyo picha ya ile room moja ilikuwa haina stima tulikuwa tunasha koroboi tulikuwa tuna stima sisi choo ilikuwa ni nje kama ulivyosema tu wewe choo ni nje hakuna stima hakuna kitanda hakuna nini unaelewa kitanda ni kimoja tu so acha nikwambie tulipo eh, tulipokata waya kidogo 
e, madangu mara moja akasema tuhame pale chuda. Mm. Twende nikinda. Ni, ni, nini ilifanya mkakata waya? Kuna dadangu mmoja alikuwa anafanya kazi, alikuwa anafanya kazi Malindi. Ah. Yeye alikuwa anafanya kazi Malindi oh. hoteli. Oh. Sasa yeye, oh, okay. huyu dadangu ndio alikwenda Ujerumani 1995. Mm. Huyu dadangu bana alipata mchumba tu. Ah. Na akaja nyumbani, yule mm. mchumba akafanya mambo yake vizuri yote. Mm. Ah, tukasema dadangu anapata pata mchumba wa majuu. Mm. You know, and the guy was really serious, okay. you know. Na kamoa, mm. na akapata mtoto mmoja pamoja. Mm. Wakaishi vizuri kabisa. So jamaa ndo alikuja akatuokole. Akamuokolea. Ah, sisi hao tukahama tukaingia mikindani na sikia mada anasema tunahama mada alikuwa anataka kuhama sana lakini alikuwa ana hela. Mm. Unajua kuna alikuwa anataka sana. Mm. Maana sisi tulikuwa tunaishi juu. Hapo mm. chini kulikuwa na majamba zisugu. Na <laughs> 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 walikuwa wananipenda kama kitu kingine. Alikuwa mgoyo story. Majamba zisugu. In fact, in fact. <laughs> in fact, <laughs> wali wawa, wali wawa na polisi because they were wanted dead or alive. Mnaishia ploti moja sema ploti moja eh sisi tuko juu hapo chini <laughs> ndio inspiration Mi, now ndio inspiration yetu mm. mimi ndio nilikuwa natuma kwenda kununua bangi <laughs> mko nenda kachonjo kule maana nilikuwa mtoto sasa wajua polisi hazi kushuku mtoto mm. so naambua ah lexi vipi nenda kachukue nenda kwa nani kachukue sita mtaja muuzaji mm. naenda ah, paka kule kwa kachonjo leo. eh mpaka leo anauza eh, si juu sasa miaka yote hiyo <laughs> Uh-huh. So naenda nachukua na waletea. Mm. Wana wana roli wenyewe, wana mm. roli wenyewe, wanavuta. Mimi niko nao pale story, yani niko na mimi ni mdogo. Mm. So alikuwa ananipenda sana. Sasa chuda pia alikuwa anaogopiwa sana kwa sababu ile ba mdogo, uh-huh. ba mdogo akina nani huyo? Ushaona? Walikuwa ni untouchable one. Eh hey, sasa mada alikuwa anasema hapa lazima tuhame. Tusipohama. Ukijana. Huyu ndio hivyo sasa. Ukijana ndio next. Ushaanielewa. Sasa huyu nafasi kutokea sisi hao mikinda. Ah. Tukaingia nyumba ya room ngapi? Mbili double zetu double room zile ama si double ah eh ile two bedroom two bedroom from one single to two bedroom to two bedroom mwende acha nikwambie two bedroom house alafu tuko na cho yetu cho yetu mm. <laughs> alafu sasa sisi wanaume bedroom yetu wanawake bedroom yao nao pale kwa sisi mtukaekewa kitu inaitwa wall unit <laughs> wall unit <laughs> nyumba yetu ilikuwa na wall unit alafu ilikuwa na stima you know tuko na stima sasa tuko na stima na tuko na cho yetu na tuko na wall unit na tv na tuko na ile ile decoder ya kucheza muziki inaitwa no ile ma music videos ile ma ile ya videos za zamani ile Ah, ile uko na finya inatoka pa 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 video linatoka hiyo kubwa ile ile kubwa ile naipata video eh, ya video record kama, kama hiyo mm. tulikuwa nayo pia ile yani unajua ni kuomoka ghafla binvu ili tuchanganya ili tuchanganya mimi nilikuwa nimechanganyikiwa kabisa kuwewa kama u eh mbele kama kumbuka kule umetoka ni wapi you know na kumbuka ulikuwa unatumika na kila nani you know <laughs> ili kuchanganya ili nchanganya kabisa mimi lakini mm. tuli enjoy si kuanzia pale mm. Mungu akawa ametushikilia ah. Okay. Nikawa sasa okay. ni 2020. Ah. Nani nimekupata. Eh, umesoma shimo, shimo. Umesoma shimo hai. Eh shimo, eh shimo la tewa. Ilikuwa boys school yetu. Mimi matumio wa matuga gaza. Ah sisi mademo wote walikuwa natubaikia wote wa Mombasa. Wajua mademo wote walikuwa nafaa wawe wawe mama gina. Wote walikuwa natubaikia mama gina wanatutaka, matuga wanatutaka, star of the sea wanatutaka, coast guards wanatutaka. Sisi tulikuwa tunataka na kila mtu. Kwa sababu sisi mimi kama matuga gaza, matuga gaza boys school yetu atakani wewe hai. Yeah, wale wa shamba. Nyote mko shamba kuvuka kwale ile kwa shamba. Kuvuka likoni tu ni ushambani kule. Ilikuwa ni ushambani. Wa. Hatutaki kwale hai. Hatutaki kwale seminari. Nataka shimo. Nataka wenyewe wenyewe. Demand ilikuwa hai. Hadi wewe ilikuwa hai. Ilikuwa hai. Ilikuwa you being in such a school ambao kweli ki Mombasa Mombasa iko na nani hiyo yani iko na hiyo kutamanika. Iko na hadhi yake. Eh hadhi yake as well. Unajua nilifanya vizuri sana mimi. Mimi ni msomi sana usinione hivi. Mimi ni mtu nilifanya vizuri. Masomo yangu mimi nimefanya vizuri sana masomo. Eh eh Mwanza. No nilifanya vizuri. Yaani mimi mpata grade gani? Mimi nilipata A. Chair. Eh? A ipi? For Apple. <laughs> Sasa eh, eh. mimi ni kwanza wajua nilipokuja hapa eh. nikakutana na jamaa ndio soma naye shimo hapa tamarini hapa tamarini tree hapa tamarini tree jamaa <laughs> flani ni mtaja ama si mtaja 
Wacha ni mtani. Hii ni podcast bwana. Hii ni podcast bwana. Hii ni baoti. Anaitwa Rono bwana. Rono eh. <laughs> Nimemwona Rono nikafurahi sana. <laughs> yaani nikafurahi sana. Washimo yule. Washimo yule. Mm. Sasa Rono mimi nikiingia form 1 Rono alikuwa yuko form 2. <laughs> Alafu alikuwa na brother yake mkubwa anaitwa Rono mkubwa yuko form 3. <laughs> Ushanielewa? Mm, mm, mm. Sasa hao wawili wajua wajua mimi kumbuka mimi nimelelewa nime, nime ghetto. <laughs> Sasa niko na uhuni. Kumbuka background yangu nimetoka hapa. <laughs> niko na uhuni mwingi. Sasa nimeingia shimo kwa shule ya wahuni sana. Mm, na mimi mwenyewe pia nimekuja pale na na uhuni sana. Wakajabu. Sasa Rono alikuwa ni babi mbaya. Mm, Ushanielewa? Mm, yaani makochini mtoto Paka leo nimemwona na muona bado yuko karata haijaisha. Mm. Bado yeye ni mtoto yule makochini. Mama yake alikuwa anakuja kila weekend. <laughs> Na gari kumtembelea kila weekend wanatembelea. Mimi kumbuka sijatembelea hata mara moja. Mimi ni ile ukiingia wewe nenda bwana. Wewe ile siku utaenda nyumbani hewa la. Kumbuka mimi ni mtoto wa mwisho katika familia ya watoto 18. <laughs> Sasa ukae ukijua mimi ni mtoto wa mwisho katika familia ya watoto. Na hakuna so, mtoto Wazazi wamelea paka wametoka. <laughs> Nikumbuka <laughs> wazazi ai wash twist sana. Wewe ukipotea shauri yako. Bila utakapoamua. Eh bila utakapoamua. Wewe 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 amua. Wewe jiambulie. Sasa Rono bwana, mm. mimi nikiwa pale, kumbuka my first day in high school. Mm. Niliingia na hiyo huni yangu yote mm. na kule shimo ilikuwa shule mbaya sana ya kiuni sana them days. Eh. Sasa hii sijui. Shimo la tea. Ilikuwa jamaa wanafika wakati hawataki kwenda hii class ya jioni, preps za jioni. Na sasa ma form 4 ma form 3 kuna mahali kulikuwa na disconnect stima shule nzima no eh no. inadisconnectiwa <laughs> eh stima inakatwa unajua shule inakatwa stima sasa stima mimi ndo nimeingia form 1 sijaelewa hizi story sasa nimeenda nime, nime nimetoka kumbuka mikenda ni primary eh mikenda ni primary nayo ilikuwa nimeingia class 8 peke yake kwa sababu ulikuwa umetoka ulikuwa ni kwa pale primary eh pale primary ilikuwa tusomi kila siku tunatoroka tunaenda beach kuogelea na kuvuta gamu okay. unajua ile gamu ya machokora <laughs> unajua gamu najua <laughs> ilikuwa pale primary yani wanafunzi okay mimi sikuwa navuta sana kiasi kidogo lakini nilijaribu mm-hmm. okay unavuta gamu una mwanafunzi ame kama teja vile wanafunzi wanakuwa kama mateja tunaenda beach tunaogelea mm-hmm. ili kwa hakuna hakuna sana masomo so that's why madangu alikuwa amesema lazima tuhame ah lazima muhame so tulipohama kanipeleka mikindani mm-hmm. so mikindani primary mimi nilinga tu class 8 mm-hmm. so kumbuka sijui wanafunzi ambao wametoka mikindani primary mm-hmm. shanielewa sasa lakini ulipita kweli ukiona washima old ah Ah. nilikata mbaya What? nilipita vibaya sana okay. vibaya ah. sana okay. nilifanya vizuri sana okay. Okay. one year within one year mm. i did really well mm. really well mikidan primary was a very good school yes. then you know yes, 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 yes. when master wao alikuwa anaitwa mr ot mm. asa mimi nikiwa shimo mm. you know kuna wanafunzi na wajua wa, shi, wa, wa mikindani mm. wenye tumekuwa nao class 8 na. Mimi kumbuka nilingia late sana eh, sababu mambo ya school fees. Eh, Nimekuwa mambo ya school fees. Mm, Lingia late sana. Sasa kuingia tulikuwa dom moja na huyu Rono. Mm, <laughs> huyu Rono tulikuwa <laughs> na dom moja. Uh, Yeye yeah, alikuwa kwa sababu brother yake yuko form 3 uh, wako katika cube. Cube flani wako ndani ya cube. Uh, Ndielewa mimi uh, sasa niko pale nje. Uh, sasa mimi my first day in school mzee. Um, my first day in school uh, nime nime pale. Uh, You know I want to I want you to, to, to understand how Shimo was eh? Okay. Okay. Tumeshuka basi na madhangu. Madhangu mm. my own mother the late. Mm. Amenipeleka. Tumeshika ile sanduku ile coffee. Unajua ile coffee na? Naipata yenyewe hapo ile bat. Yako ilikuwa ya kalabu yangu ilikuwa blue. Yes, unajua ilikuwa na zile marangi rangi zile. Eh, kwa white and blue au white and brown. Ilikuwa kwa white green, green green and some. Ah. So tumeshika na mother hivi tume tume dropiwa Shimo kule kwa barabara. Mm. Ilikuwa shule iko ndani sana. Wewe mm. ushaenda. Mm. Sasa tunatembea. Wanafunzi nao wametoka lunch. Mm. Wanarudi ile show eh, class ya fte mm. tunatembea tunakuja Tuna, wanafunzi ndio wao wanarudi mm. can you imagine i'm with my mother mm. au wanafunzi wanagonga hiyo 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 kofi nile za wewe mwache huyu mwache niko na madhangu ah. watakuchukua niko na madhangu pale uh. eh, nikasema hii shule gani you know tukafika paka pale wanaanza wanaanza kunibuli na niko na madha kabisa kafika pale of course nikapewa paka mse wale tonani hawa kukutunza sijui kwa tusikuwa ndo eh. ndo mother hai eh, ni wasi kutunza Mm. Jamaa fulani yuko form 3 pale mm. nikapewa wakunitunza mimi nikasema mimi unataka kunitunza mimi mimi. Mm. Wanijua nini? Unijua nisikie. Wewe mwenyewe naweza kukuvunja. <laughs> wewe form 3 naweza kuvunja <laughs> mimi. Mimi wanitunza mimi wewe. Wanijua nini? So akanichukua pale yetu wenzetu wao nani akanichukua nikamwambia twende. Mm. Haina noma. Mm. Eh mother nikamwambia aende mother akaniambia wewe 
wewe take care. Mm. Sianielewa. Nikitoka home wale mabrada zangu wakubwa kumbuka na mabrada wengi wakubwa. Mm. Nakuwa mm. naniambia Alex wewe tutakujua. Wale wasikwambie lolote. Yule shule ina uhuni mwingi lakini wewe ni mwanao mwanaume. Kufa nao. <laughs> eh kama ni war ni war. Kama ni mbaya mbaya. Sasa mimi huyo nikaingia pale najua kama mbaya mba. Kama mbaya. Alafu kitambo nilikuwa na mwana macho sana. Ah kwa mwana macho sana sasa macho yangu yalikuwa red throughout oh. so walikuwa nafikiri nafuta bangi lakini sifuti bangi okay nilikuwa sijaanza kufuta oh. okay tuseme nilikuwa tuseme nilikuwa tuseme tu kwamba nilikuwa naonekana kama mvutaji lakini macho yalikuwa mekundu <laughs> eh eh na sio kwa sababu ya bangi hata sasa hiyo siku ya kwanza shuleni mm. nilikuwa nimevaa t-shirt yangu ya shimo la tewa kwa ilitoa kariorama <laughs> Kwa sababu nazita Kariorama sijui kwa nini wale niliopata walikuwa na itengi. Teacher sat kumbuka ni mpya. It's my mm. first day in school. Brand new ile. So imetoka kwa karatasi. Mm. Mimi naenda dining hall. Mm. Kudish. Mm. Sasa kwenda dining hall pale nikaekiwa chakula ilikuwa unaongojiwa pale kwa si unajua kuna sufuria ya ugali mm. na sufuria ya mboga mm. ile mboga unaangukia unarushiwa nyama moja pale. Mm. So shimo ilikuwa form 3 na form 4 wanasubiri pale kwa nyama. Mm. Ikiwekwa tu wanachukua. Ah. Yaani ilikuwa ikishawekwa tu ile Kumbuka it's my first day in school mm. eh. Nyama yangu ilipoekwa ikachukuliwa. Eh. Oh kidogo ntubi matusi. <laughs> yaani mabomba. Oh tuko kapo tukasi kosa. Sio kuna mimi nasaki. Shoga nini? Wewe nini? Eh nini? Ah. Nyama kanambia itulia. Eh. Eh nikasema kwa nini hivi bwana? Itakuwaaje? Nyama yangu imeenda vipi? Nyama yangu eh. Nikazusha pale, nikapewa nyama nyingine alafu nikaitia mdomoni. Ushaelewa? Nikaitia mdomoni ile nyama. Nikasema nataka tukapo bila nyama. Nikaitia mdomoni mimi. Nikaenda kula ugali na nikaenda kula ugali na supu. You know? Nikasema ishuru, ishuru ilikuwa ni vipi? Nikitoka pale na usha sahani, sasa saa zile narudi dom. Mazi ndwali giza lishaingia, ndwali mabwana wanakata stima. Stima ikakatwa ikawa total darkness. Let me tell you, shimo latewa ndio ilikuwa iko ndani eh? mm. na miti ni mingi na kadhalika. No, so when, when it's dark it's dark. Mm. You understand? Mm. You can't operate without a torch. Nile giza yenye ukikata mkono hivi uwezi uona mkono wako. Na mimi sasa nimebaki na na, na sahani niko na best yangu yametoka nikila ni primary anaitwa mm. Pelu. Mm. Pelu alikuwa yuko next to me. So mimi na Pelu tukabaki pale kwa giza tukasimama. Mm. So now you know I don't even know where my dorm is. Kwa sababu it's total dark. Kwa sababu hapo obviously hakuna kuna preps tena. Wewe unasema nini? Sio cha zima. Sasa unajua kule walikuwa kizima wanatoa ngoma. Ile shule ilikuwa mbaya. Unasikia ngoma inapigwa kabisa watu wanasikiza ma hip hop kweli kina Dr. Dre, watu wanavuta ma weed, watu wanakunywa wanakunywa mnazi. Nazi, yani ilikuwa ni full sherehe full shang. Mafomu kuna mafomu ilikuwa shule mbaya. Sasa mimi nikawa nimekwa mapali nikasema, "Oh, nitaenda vipi dom?" Sasa ile kuzubazubaja mama mwingine akakuja na tochi akasema, "Eh, form 1 vipi? Wewe unaenda wapi?" Kabe mimi naenda dom 5. Mimi na Rodo tulikuwa dom 5. Dom 5 eh na wewe yule pelu akasema nenda dom 7. Mm. Dom 7 la twendeni niwapeleke. Yule jamaa akatupeleka dom 2. Yao yao. Alipofika pale akafungua mlango akasema, "Wewe jamaa vipi wewe? Mafomu ana hawa." Akasikia ah. jamaa anashuka. Unajua huoni chochote. Eh. So unasikia jamaa anashuka kwa bedi. Eh, eh, eh. Wacha tuanze kuchanga mkiwa. Tulipigwa. Mbona <laughs> <laughs> mfanya nini jamaa? My first day in school by the way vunjo. Now you see Manake Pelu aliambiwa tuliambiwa tu match mm. pale kwa ile corridor. Haya yeah. match nani amekuwa scout hapa Pelu akasema nimekuwa scout alikuwa mboga nimekuwa scout. Wewe yeah. vipi mimi nikamwambia mimi sijakuwa scout. Mimi nimekuwa scout vipi. Pelu jeuri kumbe. Eh wewe match basi match akasema ni match kwa nini? <laughs> Nalitao jeuri kumbuka nimekuwa akili yangu najua mbaya mbaya uh, kama mbaya mbaya yeah. kama ni war ni war. Mm. Sasa nimekaa ngumu ile. Yule mm. mzangu akaanza kwa match bwana. Sasa unajua yeye ana match anaonekana yeye tu kwa tochi. Waje maote kumbuka uwaoni. Unasikia tu sauti nyingi hata ukipigwa unasikia tu unapigwa. So uone mtu. Mm. Wao ndio wanatumulika sisi. Mm. Akamach saa kurudi kulikuwa na form 3 mwenye alikuwa mikindani primary alimuona. Kwa sababu Pelu alianza class 1. So akajua ah huyu mdogo wangu wa form 1 wa mikindani primary akamwambia yeah. kuja kama gani Pelu kuja una match nini akamchukua kiuni uni ndo akatoka naye. Akaenda na nikabaki solo. Oh, yeah. Nilipigana na umati. Nilipigana na umati wa watu. Unapigana, unajisikia? Wewe ni nani? Vitanda chini nini? Paka mwisho wake. Ngoja katika ndugu zako wale hakukuwa na mmoja pale Jeshimo. Hakukuwa na mmoja Jeshimo. Wote walisoma hamisi wale mama. Ah, wasoma hamisi. Wasoma hamisi. Day. Eh, day. Day. Mimi ndo nilienda boy peke yangu. So wale jamaa walinzidi nguvu, maana walikuwa wengi. Wakantia paka chini ya kitanda. Kile kitanda cha spring, wajua kile kitanda cha boarding. Spring kile. Wakantia chini ya kitanda pale. Sasa walipotia chini ya kitanda pale 
ile vitu vitu mingi mmoja akakuja hapa. Nakwambia story za ukweli ile shule ilikuwa na kuni. Ile kama story za jaba. Eh, si za jaba. Eh. Mmoja akakuja pale akaniambia sikiza. We hapa watakuwa hawa. Are you kidding me? Akasema wataniua vipi? Lakini kweli tumevunjana. Yeah. So t-shirt yangu imeraruliwa. Hiyo t-shirt ya pom, pom, new t-shirt imeraruliwa imeharibika. Akaniambia acha nikutoe. Waenda donga ndo mfai. Mimi nitakutoa toa kiuni uni lakini wewe tukifika pale unipatie songa ngapi? So uh-huh. mbili. Imagine tu kwa mimi mimi eh mimi nikajua hapa yenyewe <laughs> watanimaliza. Abadali ni kuba? So mbili. Kubali aishi. Nikamwambia sawa iko iko doa mtu wenzetu. Akaambia kuja hapo eh hey, hivyo ndo watu wanatolewa. Mm. Mimi huyo rrr akanipeleka paka do mfai. Nilipofika pale akadembia oe vipi sasa? Mpige so mbili yangu <laughs> nimeleza yangu. Ushamaliza? Aje dangu. Una 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 tiwa ni lakini mbona mbona unipige lakini mbona 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 umeingia na fujo mbona mbona ati 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 munipige alafu nikulipe wewe eh. wewe wewe we, una una nini newa nini wewe najua ulikuwa unatumia lugha zote leo wewe kwenda huko kaambia wewe kwenda zako wewe usimlete wewe unajidia sio wewe naambia kwenda utanifanya nini utanifanya nini wewe pale mlikuwa wengi sasa hivi utanifanya nini Kumbuka ni form 3 utanifanya nini Ndio uko mono sikio kwa kwanza eh. na yule yule ba mdogo ambaye alikuwa amembua ni shughuli shu, shu, eh, eh, eh. kumbuka tuko na ido mmoja eh, eh kaniambia wewe eh, vipi wewe kwani unajua uniform 3 nikamwambia utanifanya nini So what Jamaa kaenda zake akaniweka wanted akaenda zake Kwa hiyo ndio ulikuwa sikio kwa kwanza form 1 Kwa form 1 imagine my first day in school Nikalala ikiyo ni nik, Yaani nililala nikisema sasa kama ni vita tutapigana sana hii shule. Nikoshaaminisha. So the next day anyway I met my friends wa, wa Mikindani Prime. Wa, wa Mikindani some tani. Kuna jirani wetu mmoja pale alikuwa anitoa alikuwa anitoa Abu. So Abu alikuwa Abu, kulikuwa na unaka sawa ni jamaa wa Mikindani. Ah. Sisi tulisoma nao Mikindani Prime wewe lakini ah, ni jamaa wa Mikindani. Na hata Mikindani ni wauni. <laughs> Wachana na shule. Hata <laughs> Mikindani ni wauni. So waliponiona wale wakasema ah Alex vipi? Ba mdogo wetu huyo eh vipi? Kuna mtu amekusumbua kesho yake tu. Nikasema ah jana basi ilikuwa vita. Wakale wapi wapi? Niambia dom tu pale. Dom tu. Kitu kale eh wale walikuwa wanavapaka home clothes. Na kumbuka shule ikubali home clothes. Wao wanavapaka walikuwa wanavata t-shirts za black na hizo tauza za shimo za gray. Afu zile bagi bagi walikuwa wanaogopiwa shule nzima mwende. Ilikuwa au sasa ndio wabaya wa shule nzima. Wale walikuwa na wale walikuwa na kaivi weekend. Weekend ya na sisi. Weekend ya wakuli na sisi dom. Maana yake walikuwa nakula kuku za walimu tu. Ona wale walimu walimu wale walikuwa na usha mind tu mind tu mind tu unasikia kuku kabla haijalia sana na nakwambia this is a kweli alafu wanaenda wanaenda shanzu yule kuku yapikwa vizuri alafu wanarudi naye sasa unakuta walikuwa kina abura kinaonaka sasa ikifika dinner time wanaenda tu pale wanachukua ugali washangaa mbona hawachukui mboga hawa hawachukua tu ugali wanaenda dom alafu wanakula So tukaenda nao paka dom 2 akasema mm. twende hiyo dom 2 twende tukaenda nao dom 2 tukafika dom 2 pale wewe vipi nani alimchokoza uba mdogo wetu wewe nasikia kila mtu amepanic eh nikasema kwani hawa jamani kina nani acha mbona unaogopea hivi nani uba mdogo asiguswe na mtu alexi yule mtu akikugusa utuambie wakanipeleka paka dom yao walikuwa wanaishi dom 11 wanaishi dom yao kama eh nao wakona 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 cube zao wako dom yao yani cube zao ukiangalia ziko rough zina nguo za nyumbani alafu ni wavutaji pia wavuta taji yani unaona kabisa au watu wanaotaka unaona gasi watu watu wazima eh ni marafiki zako tena wameoa wanabidi wana watoto yani family people yani watu wazuri kabisa tena watu wazuri ajabu like it tunaongea i'm telling you so kuanzia hapo kichwa ikanifura ile kulipuka zaidi ya pale ilikuwa imefura acha nikwambie mwende kuna form 4 flani alikuja siku moja nimekaa tu hivi unajua zile viti siku na juu na chini sasa mimi nilikuwa nalala chini sio sasa nimekaa pale nafunga kiatu eh usubui ile eh usubui eh nafunga kiatu i think it was a weekend or something so nafunga kiatu i think tulikuwa tunacheza bakeo or something i don't know i can't remember sasa nafunga kiatu akakuja lile jerekani ya maji alikuwa anataka nikachote maji lakini unajua kule kwa shule ya kiune so alikuja akanigonga nayo ile jerekani ile form 1 kanchote maji kidogo ni muwe ah kidogo ni mu. Mm. Ile unajua undo? Mm. Sisi undo. <laughs> undo ni kichwa. Ah. Ile kuamka naye kichwa. Kichwa Head. chini. Unajua ile sasa unajua bed hii, alafu bed next. Uh, uh. Bed next chini. Vita ilikuwa na Fumba ya nawa fufu. Fumba ya nawa fufu. Tukatolewa paka nje. Nilipiga huyo form 4 eh. Maana ke nilisikia nilisikia. Kuna chance tuweza kuona wewe star. Mimi superstar. Ah. 
Wajua acha nikwambie mwende. Wajua watu wengi hawajui. Lakini tukiukielewa chuda. Kila siku we ni mtu uko rodi rodi and watoto wadogo tuko nafanya tizi tukijinga tu okay. for no reason okay. i think that ghetto thing so mnacheza boli alafu tunaenda beach so beach tunaogelea tusiku tunavuka tunavuka unavuka bari kabisa beach yenu ni gani maana kuna chuda ile pale pale kwa creek kwa creek, kwa creek tunavuka huko mnavuka huko mnapanda mnaanza kutoa manazi nazi mna... so kuna mambo mengi ya ki ya kiuni ya kiuni mengi sana so so uoga uoga unaisha hata kuogelea ulikuwa unafundishwa baharini ukirusha baharini tu Unarusha na mbogelea, unazama unaambiwa ogelea, hakuna kuzama. Oge, paka uli, paka ujue kuogelea. So huu ni ulikuwa usha kama mm. ulelewa chuda utakukolea tu. Itakukolea tu. Upende usipende. Uta survive. Uta survive so you will learn to survive. Is is he experience yote ime Sasa hata nikombea ya Rono kwanza. Yeah. <laughs> huu nimekutana naye hapa. Uh, Rono tumemsalimia sote. Tumemsalimia hapa. Yeah. Sasa Rono mm. ilikuwa naenda kudoya kwao. Hakuna kudoya. Hakuna eh. kudoya. <laughs> Nilikuwa <laughs> 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 naenda kudoya kwa. Kudoya, niwaambie kudoya. Eh, waambie kudoya. Kudoya ni ile hali unaenda kwa kwa kina rafiki yako, majirani eh, yako. Eh. Ukifika pale, hauna kitu ambacho wewe wafanya. Wanapika kule wajua mother you pick. Eh. So huko pale ume eh. umedoea ile umedoea. Eh, umedoea. Mpaka chakula kitakuwa eh. mezani eh. nini. Eh. Sasa mimi nilikuwa nadoea kule. <laughs> Alafu Jarono sasa brother yake mkubwa alikuwa CEO na yeye mwenyewe pia yuko CEO. Oh Jarono anataka CEO. Alikuwa na Ukristo Ukristo fulani. Mm. Sasa mimi nikawa na take advantage ile Ukristo. Naenda pale <laughs> na kaa kidogo eh hey, wataniambia mbe mambo ya Mungu kidogo nasema eh hey, kweli Ukristo ni bwana. Ukristo ni bwana kweli. Kumbe na ngoja kaha kahawa ama ile drinking chote wananipatia drinking ah. chote walikuwa maana kitu kwa mema dawa kila weekend mada anakuja kila weekend mm. so kutakuwa na chapati nini kutakuwa na vitu vitu na kula kula pale na kula oh, uh, brother yake alikuwa yo soma alikuwa form 3 eh form 3 alafu okay. alikuwa form 2 okay. so kuna vitu vitu pale nafurahia kila siku usianielewa mm. katika hiyo kujidai jidai sasa nikawa nimewapenda sana mm. lakini nao mimi siko nimemaliza hata first term sanduku yangu iliibiwa kila kitu usianielewa mm. Mm. Nasikia kwenye boys school eh butterfly. kwa boys school zinapiga butterfly. Eh katikati katiba butterfly wakachukua kila kitu. Sasa nikawa sina hata uniform. Mm. You know? Sasa uniform zile ndizo baki nazo ndio nilikuwa nazo. Mm. So the most the ideal thing to do ilikuwa niende home nikamwambia mother nunulie zengi. zengine. Lakini mimi nikasema mimi ninavona nunuliwe jamani. Mm. Si waloiba wako tu hapa. <laughs> Na uniform si zimejaa shule. <laughs> mimi pia nitai nitaiba. Mm. So one, 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 one I think Sunday wakati wote wameosha nguo nyingi wamezianika kwa sababu wakati wameanika mimi ndo nitapita nazo. So nikarauka saa 9 unajua saa nzuri ya wizi ni saa 3 a.m. sharp. Wake up iba. Hiyo wakati watu binadamu wamelala usingizi wa fofofo. Umeelewa? So mimi niliiba niliiba nilikuwa drama kumbuka. Niliiba eh, eh, drama. drama. So niliiba uniform zangu za kutosha na trouser na kadhalika. So in the next morning nikaenda kuzificha dom 11 kwa kina Abu unakumbuka mm-hmm. kazificha huko nikarudi nikaala dom 5 mm. so the next morning ile naendelea na shughuli zangu kila kitu kawaida sika oh, uniform zimebidiwa uniform zimebidiwa watu wanalalamika wanafunzwa wanalalamika kweli wanalalamika <laughs> alafu mazee ile kitu ikani break heart yangu yote mm. niliba trouser huyu rono wito muulize mungu mmoja yani rono akasema my trouser i just bought my trouser oh, it's a my, new trouser You know my mother ni nikasema shit. <laughs> Na unajua siezi mwambia. Maana ke nitapigwa mob justice. Shit. Na siezi mregeshea. Eh, eh. So itabidi tu nimkaushe mazi. Ili nioma. Kwa sababu ni watu wangu. Alikuja jua. Mungu mmoja sikudangani. Rono anajua leo. Rono, hapana. Eh, eh. Rono nimemaliza shule. Mm. Umbuka sikumwambia hata mtu yote story. Mm, mm. Sababu Uweze ambia mtu paka umalize. Ah, you get? So nimemaliza shule, nimekuja mpaka nafanya kazi radio maisha. Mimi wala itel. <laughs> Niko tu mjini <laughs> pale SB ni maeneo gani? Town tu. Ndio nikamwona Rona ni eh Alex chika Rona. Mazee ni wabia Rona usiende bali. Ingia kwa restaurant. <laughs> Niko na kitu kwa roho yangu lazima nikwambie. <laughs> Alicheka. Naambia Rona mazee sandeni. Unakumbuka ile trouser? <laughs> <laughs> ni mimi ni mimi ni mimi mimi niliiba na singekwambia maana yake ningekwambia ingekuwa ali cheka rono ningekwambia ilikuwa ningekuwa doma eh but simu aiended up um, 
kuwa mwezi kwa sababu nilikuwa niliiba hizo ma uniform nilikuja nikaiba pia vitabu vingi sana Walikuwa, vitabu vipya vipya kuna kipindi oh, kuna is there yeah. any time they walijua ni wewe ndio waiba hakuna kuna kwanza zile vitabu tulikuwa tunaiba kwenda kuviuza unajua maana kila mtu alikuwa anafanya biashara fulani kwa sababu gani unajua na shangana hizi story yeah. maana yake mimi ninakujua wewe mkiwa Barack FM mm. Barack FM is a mm. Christian station na nilikuwa nimeokoka kabisa ulikuwa umeokoka kabisa yeah. so sielewi i'm not getting it I, but that is high school unajua boys school ni kwa gani ulikuja ukabalika sana ngapi Ah nilikuja baadaye nikaanza kwenda kwa sababu sina pesa drama. Kwa sababu drama club nikaingizwa drama club ya church iliangaza unaelewa? Oh ana angaza ni. Sasa kabla mja act team naomba ukimaliza mtaomba mkaenda huko alafu unajua leader alikuwa ni Peter Odanga. So Peter alitupeleka paka mimi mwenyewe nikajisalimisha. Ukajisalimisha kwa Yesu. Tarehe ilikuwa ni 19. Mwezi ulikuwa ni wa Aprili. Ilikuwa ni siku ya Tuesday. Ilikuwa saa 9 dakika 55 mwaka ni wa 2021. Nikamkubali Kristo maisha ni mwangu. 20? Ah, 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 2001. 2001. 2001. Yes. Ukasalimishwa. Kristo kwa Paka leo niko naye. Ni mokozo maisha yangu paka dakika hii. Sisi tamzani nilikuwa me backslide chair. Ah, hakuna backslide. Hakuna Hakuna. Bora ukishakoka, bora ukishakoka hivyo. Eh. Nikawa babako, babako nafikiri hata sisi kwa babako. Ah. Babako si babako wewe. Mm. Kuna siku atasema ah si babangu tena, huyu mm. <laughs> si mtoto wangu tena. Ukishamkubali akisema kwa babako ni hivyo. Mm. So unakosa, una repent. Unakosa, una repent. Hivyo tu namnaishi tu hivyo. Na hivyo hivyo mnaenda. Kwa hivyo uko na hiyo babako forever. Eh. Amepiga simu mhesh. Mshtako mm. sana. Mshikaji wangu sana. I wish nilikuwa natamani leo wako karibu. Mshikaji wangu sana. hapa. Angeingia. Na kweli angekuwa angeingia. Anajua angeingia. Ah, mshikaji wangu sana. Angeingia. Lakini ni kama pia hii hii kazi ya uheshimiwa si si church. Maana kesi siku hizi anatafuta zaidi kushinda hata zamani. <laughs> <laughs> I think I think hii uheshimiwa iko na tena Eh. Hey, Ojo mimi nakumbuka na, na tunahenga out zaidi kushinda zamani. Are you serious? I'm serious. I mimi nashangaa hii uheshimiwa ni vipi. Niko na Ojo pia pale si si mchezo ndio nilikuwa nakuli ni usoiba umeanza kufanya kazi pamoja. Mkweli. Kwa 20 ilikuwa 20 ama 14. 14 14. 14. Eh kwa sababu nakumbuka kipindi hicho radio match nafanya rebranding. Yes. Akaletwa. Yes. You know. Yes. Usoiba ukaanza pale. Usoiba ukaanza pale. Ni rafiki wa gani jela ngo kwako? Yule siku moja akisimama kizimbani aseme mimi niko hapa kwa ajili eh. ya kuwaelezea kuhusu Alex Mwakideo eh, eh. naanguka nafu <laughs> <laughs> Yule siku atakaza sasa amesimama anasema sasa leo nawaambia kuhusiana na Alex Mwakideo naanguka nafu Afadhali nife aseme <laughs> kama siku eh aseme kama siku <laughs> Anajua mambo yako mengi. <laughs> si mengi, anajua yote. Anajua yote. Anajua yote. <laughs> Yule ni hatari. Mm. Yule ni hata kushinda kakaangu siku eh, Walai. Hata ndugu zangu wa damu yangu mm. hawanijui kama wewe bwana. Mm. Si kudanganya na kwambia. Nini nilifanya mka hit it off like that. Kwa sababu mimi na sababu background zetu nafikiri zinafanana. Mm. Eh hey, historia zetu zinafanana sana. Historia zetu zinafanana sana. Unanielewa? Let me tell you. Mimi na wewe mimi najua hivi. Eh Jelas alikuwa ameletwa afanye kazi na Esther. That's true. Yeah. Eh Esther Ingoro. Yeah. Mimi sasa nimetolewa, starabika nimepelekwa sijui where. Mm. I'm hanging around somewhere. Mm-hmm. Wewe ulikuwa usijui, ulikuwa uko uko wapi? Nilikuwa tu morning. Ulikuwa morning. Eh, morning mimi mshamba hey. na na Esther. Eh. Hey. Mimi mshamba na Esther. Yeah. Alafu kidogo kidogo Esther left. Yes, 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 yes. Now you guys were stuck together. Yes, yes, yes. Mm. Yes, yes. yes, nakumbuka because kulikuwa tukabaki mimi tena na mshamba eh. tena na na jalas mm. alafu ikawa tena wajua tulikuwa tunaongea wajua wajua mdosi wetu bana mm. alivyo vile huwa ana, mm. ana, anapenda kazi nzuri TJ mwenyewe yeah, TJ Tom eh. Japan Big eh. Boss Mopa I know yeah. Le Patro <laughs> Le Big Boss <laughs> Yeye yeah, iko ni mkutano daily so katika ile mawazo na kubadilisha mm. mawazo kila siku Of course yeye yeah, akasema Let's try this. And you guys became big buddies. Ngakuwa mm. marafiki wa ajabu. Kabisa kabisa. Kama mgoe kwa magazeti, ilikuwa inaitwa Big Boys, ama ilikuwa inaitwa nini ile kitu yenu? Ilikuwa inaitwa je, ilikuwa mnaenda kule Porini. Wa oh, Porini, kulikuwa eh. na Porini na kulikuwa na ile Boys Club. Boys Club. Eh, kulikuwa porini kulikuwa jaribu kuniambia siku moja nikakataa. Nilikataa mm, ile. Nilikataa. Mm, <laughs> 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 ilikuwa mbaya ile. Ha, ilikuwa mbaya. Ile ile kwa ile kwa mbaya. Anga una hapana, hapa hey, sifai kwenda. Roho bwana aliniongoza. Eh ilikuwa alikusaidia roho. Alinisaidia. Roho alikusaidia. Roho mnafanya nini pale porini? Nini alikuwa mnafanya? Story zimekuwa nyingi. Pale nini? ilikuwa ni kujiachilia. Mm. Pale ilikuwa kama gari yako ina brake unangoa. <laughs> unangoa ile brake na ile handbrake unatoa kabisa. Alafu unaeka kwa D. 
alafu sasa unaacha achilia achilia yeye sasa achilia yeye kila mtu gari yake ilikuwa hivyo kila mtu hakuna gari ilikuwa na handbrake ama brake zilikuwa zimeongolewa kabisa sasa mengi alifanyika pale mengi alifanyika pale eh lakini zaidi hatukuwa hatukuwa watu wabaya mambo tu ya kawaida unajua hii ni Nairobi Eh, so mambo tu ya kawaida. Hapa ni town. Hapa ni town. Hapa ni town. Hapa si shago. Hapa si shago. Hapa si shago kabisa. Hapa ni town. Watu eh, wanatafuta hela, eh. wakipata hela wanazitumia pia vizuri. <laughs> <laughs> wanazitumia vizuri. Eh? Alafu eh, ni trend. Paka tukaandikwa na yule fala mm. akatufanya tukatrend. Uli trend hiyo siku nilikuombea. Eh. Unajua ni rafiki yangu. Kweli. Nilikuombea. Eh? eh yule mm, mm. kidogo niseme msenge sana. <laughs> <laughs> yule 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 jamaa ali aliharibu sana. Shaona eh? Aliharibu sana. Mm. So eh, aliniweka katika shida sana. Uh. Aliniweka katika shida na na wife, <laughs> na familia, familia kina wife. Uh. You know? Mm. Yet me msafi kama pamba. Ah! Msafi <laughs> kama nini? Kama pamba. Pamba ambayo ni new. Uh. Kama pamba. Mm. Ile kuwekwa katika macho ya public namna ile, you know, kuakizua vitu vingi. Mm you know mm. wewe mke wako mimi najua kwako tumesoma school moja eh hey. hey. ili ili fanya nilimwambia mke wangu kila kitu unajua mimi huwa ni mtu ambaye ni mkweli sana mm, mm. so nilimwambia mke wangu mm. sita kudanganya huyu mm. ni ukweli eh mm. nilimwambia mke wangu ukweli wote mm. akaniuliza maswali yake yote magumu maswali magumu na nikamjibu yote mm. nilipaka kaniambia nipatie simu yako niangalie nikamwambia simu ndo hii mama weka password na nikamfunza hadi password yangu nikamwambia password yangu ndo hii sasa akawa yeye hata labda kama uliongelea kwenye Instagram kama wakati fulani ulijibiwa na yeye. Maana yake alikuwa kuna full access ya simu yangu kwa muda mrefu by the way. Waja. Karibu 3 months after your incident. Nilimwambia because nilimwambia mama nisamee nimekosa. <laughs> mama fanya nini? Nisamee. Nimekosa. Mm. Mimi ni mwenye dhambi. <laughs> Mimi ni mwenye dhambi. <laughs> mama akansa. Kwa hivyo alikuwa kweli yale. Na kuna dhambi kadha wa kadha. <laughs> Sio na? Akaniambia ah na hii dhambi je? <laughs> Nikamwambia nilikosa. Yeah. Na hii dhambi nyingine hapa mama nisamee. <laughs> na hii huku mama e. Unaipenda familia. One thing about I Kama love mama, about you chair. Yeah. Unampenda mke wako, unapenda watoto wako, unapenda familia sana. Sana. Yule mm-hmm. Yule even in a thousand years itamua tena. Mm-hmm. Sidhani kama kuna mwanamke mwingine ambaye. Mimi nafikiri Mungu alinekea yule. Mm-hmm. Yule ndo roho yangu kabisa. Ni, nampenda ni, ni, sana. Mimi hii nakufanya unampenda mke wako. Unajua siku hizi ni mrembo. Na mimi nina bibi mrembo. Yupo. Na si mrembo tu. Mrembo mm. sana. Mm. Na right? kili. Na pia ana akili. Alafu ni mwanamke anatulia na jiheshimu. Mm. Ushanielewa? Mm. Na nitoka familia yenye heshima. Mm. Ushanielewa? Mm. Na najua kunitunza pia. Mm. Najua kunitunza mbele. Na ananielewa sana. Okay. Shanielewa. Mm. So kuna mambo mengi tu ambayo nimekuepo katika hii dunia na nimekutana na watu wengi mm. lakini eh karakter yake ni tofauti. Yule yeah. yule ndo wangu jamani. Mm. Yule ndo wangu. Eh. Yeah. Nimekumbuka ama tuseme hiyo. Ama hii ni podcast. Ipi. Ile tukienda wasini yule. Ha lakini chea. Nilikuwa sija wao anaweza kama ni. Ah lakini nakumbuka nilikupeleka wasini kama leo na mtu mwingine. Disemba no. <laughs> 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 lakini <laughs> lakini kwani ilikuwa lini wasini? Ilikuwa mwezi wa asikumbuke lakini sikumbuke kama mwezi wa ngapi? Nikasikia wao. Ah, ulikuja wao. Ah, lakini napenda vile ambavyo yani eh. napenda vile ambavyo tangu uwe mke wako eh. mwenye umesimama naye. Eh. Una respect. Eh. Mm. Eh, na ni kweli nakumbuka ile safari tulikuwa na mtoto fulani hapo. Eh. Sitamtajaji. Ah, usimtaje. Sitamtaje. Ah, kwa heshima. Unajua wewe die mwenye ni rafiki yangu yani follow wewe. Unajua kwa kila mtu kabla hajao wako mm. nakuwa gana. Yo. Options. By the way, what do you So now you're, you're setting up your mind. You you decide tachukua huyu ama nichukue huyu. So kulikuwa na watoto wawili watatu pale angalia. Bibi yangu alishinda. What do you think alishinda ile? Alishinda hiyo. Nilikuwa atakuuliza hayo maneno ya kwamba kama la ujao ama kabla hujakuwa katika mahusiano thabiti. Yeah. What do you think about people sharing uh, now their past wakiwa now kama washapita na hiyo situation. Afu waje washe mambo yao kwa mfano kama sasa hivi ile yeah. nikianza kuuliza wewe demu yeah. anataka kuniambia ni nini? Do you think it's right ama si right? Kwamba na share my past. Eh unieleze kuhusu wewe demu wengine uanze kunieleza. Ah, mimi sioni gere, mm. sioni shida. I don't think there's a problem at all, mm. you know? As long as mwenzako anakuelewa, oh, yeah. hamna shida yote. Mm. Mimi sipendi maisha ya kujifunga. Mimi mm. mwa anasema kama ningekuko brand, mm. uh, logo yangu ingekuwa I mean, uh, ito nini? Slogan yangu ingekuwa limitless. <laughs> you know, kama ningekuwa brand, <laughs> ningekuwa Alex Mwakideo, limitless. Mm. You know, mm. sipendi wanajifunga funga nini? Mm. 
Nataka tu ujiachilie kabisa mm. na mwenzako akukubali vile ulivyo. Madem wao ndio unawafuata Insta au wanakufuata Insta kwenye DM. Kwenye DM? Mm. Ah, kwenye DM. Mm. Squeeze hakuna sana DM. <laughs> Kuna wakati zilikuwa zimechacha. <laughs> squeeze hakuna sana. <laughs> Majua eh? Mm. Ah. Eh, so mm. sukuma sukuma tu kidogo. Sukuma maisha. Eh, Alafu ni nimeingia gym sasa. Uh-huh. Pombe nimeacha gym ina discipline yake. Uh-huh. Ina discipline manake kuna vitu uwezi kufanya unachoka manake. Uh-huh. Piga zoezi unachoka. So uh-huh. unapiga biashara yako mbili tatu ukiingia home utaki tena kukaa sana. Uh-huh. Unataka tu kulale uone watoto wako familia yako utulie. Uh-huh. You know? Eh, so mambo mengi yamebadilika. Na, na, na gym unaenda daily? Monday to Friday. Wacha. Mm, Monday to Friday. Uh-huh. Mm. Ah unikumbusha kitu juzi alinitengeza dreadlocks the guy who made my dreadlocks was asking about you oh. eh ako pale ako pale ako pale somewhere ako pale Mombasa mm. road somewhere eh. akanambia ah mwakideo alimaliza nini hiyo mambo yake ya politics ah alikuwa acha ukiwania alinacha sikuwania ulikuwa umetoa azma kweli sikuwania nilikuwa nimeshtua shaona mm. nilikuwa nimeshtua umati nione reaction iko namna gani. Sababu huenda kuania kiti cha undani. Eh kiti cha undani. Mm. Na unajua ningewania ningemwangusha yule mbunge asubuhi na. Ah. <laughs> Kweli? Ah. Wajua undani ni kwetu eh? Mm. Na jina la Mwakideo na familia Mwakideo iko undani nzima. Mm. Shaendelea kwanza mm. kabisa karibu wale wote ni relatives wangu. Mm. Mm. Sasa mm. wapiga kura wote tayari mm. wanampiga mtoto wao. Mm. Ushaendelea maana mm. familia yetu kumbuka ni kubwa sana. Mkubwa eh? Si kubwa kidogo, ni mm. kubwa sana. Mm. Alafu babangu na mamangu wote wametoka kule undani. Mm. Hakuna timu mtu ametoka ati ati alitoka Mbololo mm. ama wapi? Pamoja. Pamoja sote. So mimi nikiingia undani naweza lala mbale, naweza lala undani yenyewe, nikienda beso na lala. Uko na mahusiano na huku, kuna uncle, Ama ndugu zako kat... wengine uko na mahusiano nao? Eh upo? Ah, sawa. Upo. Mm. So unanielewa eh? Sasa undani ni kwetu sana. Mm. Sana sana sana. Sasa Yaani hata mbunge mwenyewe unaweza kutumia nani mara ngapi? Eh. Aliniita mara kama karibu mara tano. Wacha. Mwakidio are you serious? Mwakidio bwana utafanya hai si ungoje tu nimalize miaka 5. Maana kile oh, yeah, kusema yeye anataka kupiga tu miaka 10 alafu oh. atoka. ni ngoje tu. Utaingia kwa hivyo. Mimi naambia usiwe na wasiwasi. Mm. Ni rafiki yangu. Namwambia bwana mwashako mimi sisimami. Mimi sisimami wetu lia. Usimami tena lakini bwana nikienda kwa ground hata ananiambia mwakidio you haja. Mwakidio bwana unaambia hivyo bwana. Hivi so, 2027 wingi Nilimwambia mwashako ah, 2027 is another story. Oh, okay. Is another story. Mm. Totally different. 2027 nitakuwa. Nitakuwa. Mm. Utakuwa ndani. Eh, lakini sana sana si lazima niwe ndani. Ah. Taita tapeta ni. Hata Mombasa. Kaunti nzima na nitaji. Eh, na kuitaji. Kaunti nzima, na Kaunti nzima na imekutamani wewe. Eh, wacha nikule kule. Eh, umekosa ume, amengia baridi, anaweza kuomiwa. Mm, Mungu akui nikutama red. Hayuko mm. sawa. Mm. Ni mtamu. Ni eh, ni mm. barbecue dizo, barbecue chicken wings. Mm. Hapa Tamarind Tree. Eh hapa Tamarind Tree Hotel. Unarauka asubuhi, unamkasa ngapi? Kwenda mm. job. Kazi ya Ni squeeze na mkasa. Mm. 9:30 hadi 10. 9:30. 9:30 hadi 10. Hapo mm. between 9:30 na 10:00 nimeamka. Mm. Mm. Expressway the Casita ni town. Mm. Ngia town ingia kazini pale jipu panga panga kidogo ingia. Mm. Umefanya vizuri. Mm. You you've done well for yourself as Mashkul. a Mashkul. as a brand. Mimi ambaye nakujua tangu when I was an inside at Barack you know? FM you know? when I was fan back yeah. in Diani. Eh yeah, so kuget na yeye hapa nashukuru sana. Alikuwa intern wetu Simone hivyo na niodi sasa. Alikuwa intern wetu alikuwa anavaa zile beads. Unajua zile beads? Alikuwa anavaa che beads. Beads alafu anatengeneza beads na tuzia beads. Alikuwa anatuzia beads usimone hivi. I mean she's really doing well. Chan nilikuwa nakuuliza uko kwenye movie sasa hivi ya Netflix inaitwa Nafsi. Ile premiere last year on kwa theater. Nakumbuka nilikuwa nimepata mwaliko wa Ruben Odanga pale. Lakini mtoto alikuwa mdogo sikuweza kuhudhuria. Congratulations. Asante na shukuru. Clarence wetu Clarence kwenye movie. Clarence yes. Is this your first big movie? Uh, it's my first movie. Hakuna big na small. Ah watch. Tangu theater mpaka sasa? Eh movie. I mean zile zile, zile za kostigini eh yeah. stage tangu stage this is the second time i'm doing this mm. but ilikuwa ni kitu nimefanya after 
many years mm. una kumbuka theater jamani mm. miaka mingi iliyopita sikuwa nimeact kwa miaka mingi sana mm. kiukweli zamani nilikuwa actor mm. na hivyo. wewe unajua hivyo mm. familia yetu sote mm. sisi mm. ilikuwa familia kule Mombasa ya kina Mwakideo mm. ya kina Odanga eh, eh, you know tulikuwa eh, sisi ni maacta eh, zama hizo eh. lakini sisi tulitoka maana acting ilikuwa haina hela eh, sio so nimekaa miaka mingi sana until time Ruben akaniambia come and try mm. come and try this part naona no, no, mm. kama unaweza ifaa oh, ah. ndio nikaenda uh-huh. so ilikuwa he! Uh-huh. hey <laughs> What? Uh, uh, Ilinitia wasiwasi mwingi sana. Because at that time, mm. you know first of all I'm thinking about my brand. Uh, you understand? The person Babu, that I have become. Clarence the player. Eh, yeah, you know. Player, yeah. Yeah. Clarence is a total Nairobi man. Yes. You know, yule jamaa wa Nairobi mwenye waifaki kosha go lakini anakwanya makekes. Anasababisha. Anasababisha mbaya. Sasa director alikuniambia kuhusiana na hiyo party do. Tena kaniambia hiyo ndio inakufaa kabisa. Akamwambia ndugu yangu kwani umeona nini kwangu? Kwani umeniwonaje wewe? So kwanza nikawa na shida sana. Alafu unajua sasa tena nimekuwa paired na Kate Actress. She's a big shot. She's a big shot mm-hmm. in the industry. Mm-hmm. It's not a job. I know. How do you just Wajua? Mm-hmm. Eh sasa unajua sasa Kate yuko hapa and even Kate is telling me Mwakideo give you all mm. I'm here you know mm. ananiambia jiachilie Hello you know jiachilie <laughs> ile movie na mambo kuna mambo uh. eh, 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 eh. <laughs> kuna 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 pahali nilikusikitikia kuna mm. kuna mahali there's a rap hmm? there's a rap scenario ama yeah, yeah. rap iko eh hiyo ilikuwa ni kuigiza kama rap I know ilikuwa ngumu hizo parts zilikuwa mm. ngumu sana mm. zilikuwa ngumu sana hizo parts mm. sana 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 hata wachana na rap mm. ile violence tu ah, ile violence you know mimi mimi i love women mm. au unawapenda na pele unajua kuwashabikia na kuwashabikia <laughs> na kuwafurahia najua <laughs> na mimi nina watoto wa kike ambao ah, ni baba girls mimi baba girls me i'm the only man in the family so mimi mm. anything anything against women eh huyo umenigusa roho yangu ah. umenigusa roho yangu so now ndo nikapewa hiyo part nyingine mbaya kabisa yenye hata ah. mambo sio yangu ah. yani roho yangu ilitatizika sana okay you know so apart from that hata ile part ile part part ya romance ile mm. you know there was a time hata director alikuwa anatuuliza kama can you guys kiss mm. eh. you know Kate is married eh, I'm also married eh. and this is my first time Yeah. on set maze yeah. wataka <laughs> we ile kwa sim chat yani hiyo kupendana hiyo eh hey, it was a lot of work i can't lie to you but it was a lot of work it was a lot of work but, but then again i loved it because nilikuwa nasema kama basi tutakuwa katika movie basi tuwe katika movie ambayo ina make sense okay. you get mm-hmm. uh, because uh, pia kuwa katika mahali ambapo tena ita ile movie yenye hadhi yake ina professionals absolutely i can tell you for sure yule jamaa multan mm. huyu ruben odanga huyu mm. ni hatari fire anajua because pale kwa shoot mm. ungeona a lot of professionalism okay yani another level like i could i, I could feel like almost i'm working with watu wako standards za hollywood mm. or something because ukiangalia setup o oh, yani organization na kila kitu mm. Una, unajua wenyewe hapa ni either uwe ama ama we mwenyewe tu shauri yako Ngoja. you can't blame anyone tunakutarajia kwenye movie zingine Mwenyezi Mungu akipenda okay. nake ni kitu nimefurahia uh-huh. mwenyewe nimefurahia binafsi uh-huh. yangu uh-huh. i feel personally that um, given an, an opportunity maybe i would have done much more better mm. you know but um, ningependa sana kuwa katika movie zingine lakini movie zenye zina make sense hata kwangu Hi. you get because yeah. now i'm talking about eh yeah. hadhi ile na pia mm. story ambayo ina make sense okay. you know si tu kwa pia mm. you know pia kwa pia pia sana unashusha hadhi yako mm. na unashusha unashusha brand yako chini when you brand okay uh, yeah. to be nitakuwa nakosea kutofanya hivi kuuliza kuhusu wewe na jalas you know having a show hata kama si radio show because people loved you duo yeah kenya tunapenda mimi mwenye mm. shabiki mm. every time i come across you ni new on tiktok mm. lazima ni stop yeah. you know whatever i'm doing yeah. angalie yeah. tutawai on alex na jalas tena kwenye bunge labda ala <laughs> bunge radio <laughs> 
kwa kuja. Bunge Radio. Asante sana. Shukrani kwa kuja. Thank you so much. Yeah. Thank you for having me. Yes I have. Mm. You know me mm. nikiona wewe any time any day. Inakuwa ni full burudani full kipupu. Nilikuwa naogopa hiyo ni after 3 hours. Nilikuwa naogopa. Nilikuwa naogopa. Alikuwa tamu. Alikuwa tamu. Thank you so much. Shukrani sana kwa kuja. I yeah. know you woke up very early. Unahitaji yeah. kukurelease sasa. Yep. Eh. Unahitaji kumrelease Alex Mwakideu yeah. aende kwa sababu tomorrow he has another show in the breakfast. Shukrani sana kwa kuja. Jamani tune uh, in uh, Milele FM asubuhi. Sio? Yep. Yeah. Eh, kuanzia saa 12 asubuhi mpaka saa 4. Mpaka saa 4 yeah. ndio tutamkuta pale Alex Mwakideo. Shukran sana. Thank you so much for tuning in. Of course you can uh, listen to the audio pale kwenye Spotify, Google Podcast, Apple Podcast. Of course on YouTube it's at EMM Online TV. Subscribe please, you know, and hit the notification button and uh, I'll see you again. Naitwa Mwende Masharia. Thank you so much uh, Tamori Hotel for having us. Ciao ciao